four terrific matches coming up for you to kick us off Amanda Sobi, the number three seed taking on her compatriot Olivia Blatchford Klein, the number seven seed. Yeah, she's got to get her teeth into this game right now, really. Five one down. Start hitting a little bit more positively and uh, giving herself opportunities around the front. That's uh, took in the front. Me. Wow, was, what an attack that and was. Now Seriously. Six for one. That was a big hit. Beautiful shot. As soon as she serves that ball, she's in on it. She's proving very, very tough for Olivia Blatchford. Blind. She's the worst player you could possibly play, Toby, if you're just a little bit rusty or a little bit slow starting. It's absolutely ruthless. These two are friends off the court, but uh, that all goes when that door is shut. 9-1. Now it's a loose attack, if you can call it that, to the front of the court. And it's Eleven one. Well, game to Sobi. Sobi needs one South game to love. Sobi. A lot of power. Taking the ball early, cleanly. For the squash, it's things very, very, very difficult here. We have to try to distance the adversary. For Olivia Blatchford, six minutes, first game. Thank you. That's much better again from Blackford Klein. This is how we know she can play. Klein moves her around the court and plays a little bit more away from the racket and the volley of Sobi. That's a great shot, Joey. Really good variation across the court. She took it late Eight here. Four. I mean, that's for it to bounce twice before that side ball takes a lot of skill and dexterity. One game ball saved for Sobi. Oh, she went to play it. There's a little bit yeah, of experience. Yeah, six. yeah she. Game uh, two, that's for nine. One game all. But when you think about the way Olivia Blatchford Klein has played in that second, thoroughly deserves to take it and be in this position. 18 minutes between the two girls from the USA. It's now one game apiece. But that was superb. I mean, the artillery that she has. We're talking about Amanda Sobi in the first game. Is the skill level to play those balls? off the ground and on the volley across the top of the tin explaining to the viewers how much skill and dexterity that takes i mean she's looking great absolutely she's got uh, a slightly different skill set to amanda sober they're both attacking but uh, she has great dexterity and and uh, i think she uses her wrist a little bit more perhaps than than sobi so that's why she's able to do a couple of those flicks and get it so low across the court and it's and you read it very late it's, it's hard to pick up isn't it yeah, she keeps it a little bit more simple, I would say, than a Blatchford Klein. He likes to, as I said earlier, just use the wrist sometimes and deceptive shots, but perhaps she tries a bit too much at times. Sobi keeps it really, oh. really simple and, and basic, but very attacking. She takes it early. Fine, love. Yeah, good dying length. Well, we often talk about this, Joey. Would she go for the bagel against her good friend or would she would she be nice about it happened at canary wharf didn't it with uh Castanet and sam todd nine love Castanet in the end uh down well, I think she kind of <laughs> has a wry smile between the two friends. American number one and two. No bagel for Sobi. Hand out. 
110 match ball. She does, uh, Amanda's demeanor on court's quite funny. She always looks completely and utterly exhausted, but she's uh, far from it. Oh my goodness me, that was sick. 11 1. So sharp. Very, very sharp. Match to Sobi, two games to one. Sobi. Looking very, very solid. It's good that she had a bit of a scare in that second. Olivia Black did play superbly well in the second. Best squash I've seen her play. And that will really sharpen up Amanda Sobi. 26 minutes, a good run out here. Ropey, that movement there know, from Perry here from Whitlock. Oh my goodness, man. Well, she's uh, started off exactly as she finished Four, one. two days ago. Beautiful shot there, Jerry. <laughs> Beautiful. Got lovely camera cut as well. Good timing in the camera angle uh -huh. on that one. Really Nine, was. The technique was perfect. You could really see her coming down on the ball. Great serve. Oh, man. perfect squeeze. That's perfect squash. Serve, yeah, nice. volley return, and then the follow up. Brilliant squash. You can't fault it. All those uh, young. Players looking to improve. The service is so important. All stem from the serve, this rally. Closing out the first game and deservedly for Emily Whitlock. Leading the England number one and the number two seed for this event by one game to love. This is better from Sarah Jane Perry. Bit of a leg raise, Three, taking two. that drop shot in. Edging it in. Slightly strange one. Kind of got away with it though. Yeah, she just didn't commit on that one. Problem is, for Whitlock, Perry's starting oh, wow. to move a bit better, but if she can play shots like that, took that very low down across the body. That's impressive. And out, 5-9. That's a high boast. 11-8, game to Perry, one game on. The Sherry J. Perry. Just holding off Emily Whitlock in the second game. One all three, old Pete Parkey. Slender lead here. Just starting to move a little bit better. But she's not going to get that back. Goodness me. Tight length, perfect squash. And then the beautiful volley. There's the length. Six on. Impressive. Again, the backhand side Eight, for Sarah Jane Perry. This time off the bounce and uh, couldn't get much better. Than that. So yeah. the error giving Sarah Jane Perry two match balls for a place in the semi finals here in Nantes. And she's done it. She just Eleven squeezed it. To Perry. Two games to one. So Perry hugely Eleven, relieved. 11, 11, Very vocal. 11, Emily Whitlock having a 
Superb event. Massive improvement for her over the summer. I mean, she was so, so close there, Parkey. Couldn't have been any tighter. Yeah, wonderful effort from Whitlock. 34 minutes of duration between these two. Ladies, 2-1 victory for the number two seed.